Hello everybody. So I'll try to do the reading again on the elections for the Senate in November. Uh, quite a few of you guys have told me that you felt uncomfortable because I lay out the spread. I put the Republicans in the left and the Democratic Party in the right. So I will do it opposite now. I will put the Democratic Party in the left and the Republicans in the right. Alright, so let's ask again. Uh, show us what will be the result for the Senate elections in November. Who's most likely to hold the majority? Oops. <laughs> Two cards. And now the Republicans. Okay, so let's see the Democratic Party. The Fall. The Ace of Pentacles, King of Swords. Seven of Wands, Ten of Wands, mm. Eight of the Six of Cups. All right, uh, let's see the Republicans. Uncertainty. Now they have the Devil. The Eight of Wands. This is Trump. Things are moving fast. Okay, <laughs> so now I'm actually more optimistic about the Democratic Party. We have here with the full a new beginning, faith and trust, Ace of Pentacles again, growth, new beginning, a new opportunity, the King of Swords, they mean business, <laughs> they take control. Uh, now the others are blocked with the seven of wands from the outside. I take it this is from the Republicans. They are blocked, but it's a heavy burden now for the Democratic Party also, because uh, with the six of cups, um, there might be some unrealistic expectations, maybe or. I'm not sure about this Six of Cups, it's, it has like a very ungrounded energy. But for the Republicans now I have the, the moon, we have the moon which is uncertainty, fear, illusions, the devil card, and the emperor I take it, this is Trump, bound, because of Trump they're gonna fall down because they chose to go with Trump despite everything uh, self-destruct and now they're worried so yeah at least from this reading this time we got a more favorable outcome for the Democratic Party and it's really bad for the Rep Republicans um, let's do it again, just to make sure. Let's do again. What's the outcome for the Senate elections in November? Maybe the energy shifted. Now we Kavanaugh and people are getting riled up. This is the Democratic Party. And this is the GOP, the Republicans. All right, so Four of Swords, again Ace of Pentacles. This is Trump's energy from the outside, the tower. Just wait, wait, patience. 
Hmm. Maybe this tower is about Trump. They're planning. They're waiting patiently. This is an opportunity for them, maybe to bring down Trump's tower. Let's see the Republicans. Yeah, seven of wands for them. They're blocked. Compromises. Ace of wands. This is new beginnings. This is from outside. This is the. Yeah, they're not gonna get seven of pentacles. Knave of Swords. I could see this as the Democratic Party is given a new chance, but it has to do a lot with bringing down Trump. I see sometimes this Five of Swords is Trump, the narcissist card, the selfish, all about himself, and bringing down the tower. It's probably that's why the people will turn out and vote for them because they want Trump Tower to come down. So this is what is helping the Democratic Party. Uh, there's still a lot of planning. Things are not going to be fast. It's going to take time. Uh, but they, they have a new chance here. And here with the Republicans, whatever they were thinking, they're not going to get it. The Seven of Cups. Um, didn't materialize block this is for from outside this is the democratic party energy again new beginning another ace growth power now they have the power is on the outside and they have to make some all kind of compromises and it's more favorable for the democratic party I think they have a good chance to win the senate um, maybe something shifted. Maybe it has to do with now with Kavanaugh. Maybe this will convince people to go out and vote to bring down Trump. I think this this is why they're gonna give be given a new opportunity <laughs> to have the power is closely related to Trump falling down. You know, like when you're voting for someone, sometimes not because you believe in them, but because you want their adversary to go down in flames. So a lot of people, even though they may not agree with the Democratic Party and everything, they will, but they will, this time they will to, to bring down Trump. Yeah, I don't know. As I said, maybe the energy shifted somehow because I get a different response now from the other days. So, it might have to do something with Kavanaugh. Okay, so this was the reading. Uh, I will try and do some more updates as we're getting closer to the elections to see kind of where the energy is. But right now it looks like it's uh, in the Democratic Party's favor and I hope it stays so. Alright, so thank you guys for watching and I will see you later. Bye-bye.